150 miles from where we are in the thoroughly modern and bustling city of Los Angeles sits a drought-stricken town where indoor running water is a thing of the past. The water has run out for thousands of farm workers and others who depend on private wells that have run dry. But thanks in part to one tireless volunteer, no one is going thirsty. From East Porterville, California, here's Jacob Rascone with our Making a Difference report. Hi, I'm Donna Johnson, and I live in East Porterville. Every week, it's the same routine. Yeah, I'm going to go get Donald to help us. Four cases for the tire shop yeah, owner. That's enough for your house, too, right? What else can you do? There's no water, there's no water. Stops at dozens of otherwise forgotten homes. We got more water for you. We'll just put two at each house. At 72, Donna Johnson is retired. Did you get enough or do you need one. one more? Okay. But can't stop volunteering. Every day is terrifying to some of these people. No well. When I say some of these people, I'm one of them included. Thousands of people in Tulare County, many of them migrant farm workers, now live without running water. Imagine. No flushing without a bucket. No bath for two-year-old David. This is where you wash it. Until the water delivery. Oh, no, no, no. Dirty laundry sits for days or longer. Forget about a real lawn, dishwasher, or turning on a faucet, period. It's worse here than Mexico. Emergency state funds and donations provide for disaster management, community showers, truckloads of bottles and water tanks. But for the people of East Porterville, the real water savior okay. is Donna Johnson. Go Why do you do this? Uh, to me, it's a gift <laughs> to be able to help these people. It's hard, and I thought I wouldn't do it this long, but I'll continue doing it until hopefully they have some permanent solution. With dozens of new wells drying up every week, the only real solution here is rain. Thank you. Jacob Rascone, NBC News, East Porterville, California. That will do it for us on a Friday night. I'm Lester Holt in Los Angeles. For all of us at NBC News, thank you for watching. Good night, and have a good and safe weekend.